you know, huddling down with a nice warm blanket and listening to him, you know, read his own stuff. So um, I'm going to have to see if if either of those are an audio and if he's reading them. Um, that way I can at least listen to them in the car when I'm to, going to and from work. Um, so we'll see. But uh, yeah, so Ocean at the End of the Lane is, I think, is going to come up before Coraline for me, but uh, I do know I need to read Coraline. Honestly, like the one thing that's kind of struck me like while watching this whole interview with like Neil Gaiman is that like because he's such like a hugely successful like author and he's like I mean he wasn't always like that of course but like especially in the past like 20 odd years he's been such a hugely successful like world renowned writer but he still manages to be like very like down to earth very like. <laughs> He's human, like as a person. Like I really, um, 